Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. As mentioned in previous videos, Google is rolling out Google Drive for desktop to replace the old backup and sync client and utility that many of us were using uh, in Windows uh, for our backup solution. And I have posted videos previously on this topic, which I will leave all of those down below in the description box if you are interested. Now, the purpose for this video uh, is I just want to do an update to yesterday's video I posted and a quick correction. Um, and, and in yesterday's video, I posted just about the new drive, Google Drive, which I, uh, you know, installed. I uninstalled Backup and Sync, and I installed Google Drive. And I just went through some of the features and the settings and so on. And as I say, I will just leave the link to that down below if you're interested. And what I mentioned in that video is that there was no files on demand for the backup and sync utility. It basically just linked your, your files, it just linked to your files um, online instead of saving the files onto your PC. Now that I'm going to make a correction to, um, that was an error. It actually can um, make your files available offline. So if we just pop over to our file explorer, and I go to my drive, you can see it pops a drive here into your file explorer. But if I go to my drive, you can see I have now folders that are actually synced two-way. So yesterday I mentioned there, there wasn't a two-way street. There was no files on demand. It was only, um, it only linked you to your files online. It didn't actually download them to your PC. And there is an option that has been pointed out to me uh, after making that video. And that's why I just wanted to update you with this video. Um, as obviously I didn't want to um, give you the wrong information. So if you right click on a folder, you will see here now there is a lot of options. It says open with Google Drive, copy link to clipboard, share with Google Drive, add shortcut to drive. And here we go. Very easy. Offline access. And you just go from online only to available offline. And it saves all those files onto your PC. So it's just like Nextcloud and OneDrive where it's a two-way street, it's files on demand. What you have on your computer is what you have in the cloud. And if we go to one that hasn't been synced, this is only available online, not offline. You can see if I go offline access, I can make it available uh, uh, offline, where at the moment it's only uh, has online access. So I just wanted to make that quick correction that this is actually a handy feature that if you just right click the folder, you can make those files available offline or online only depending on your choice. And I've actually fiddled a bit with the uh, Google Drive, the uh, new backup uh, client. And the more I'm using it, the more I am actually starting to like it and prefer it over backup and sync. But obviously this will have mixed reviews. But at the moment, you know, it's still early days, as I mentioned yesterday. But I'm actually starting to enjoy the new uh, Google Drive as opposed to backup and sync. So you can make those files available. I just wanted to make that correction. You can make those files available offline if you want to in the new Google Drive for desktop. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.